Xbox System Error E203 is an error code that some Xbox One users have encountered, causing frustration and interruption to their gaming experience. This error typically indicates a problem with the console's operating system and may prevent the Xbox One from starting up properly. Understanding the potential causes and troubleshooting steps for Xbox System Error E203 can help users resolve the issue and get back to gaming. One possible cause for Xbox System Error E203 is a corrupted system update or a failed update installation. Xbox One console regularly receives system updates to enhance performance, add features, and address any bugs or security issues. If an update process is interrupted or if there are issues with the download update file, it can result an error like E203. Another factor that contributes to this error is a hardware-related problem such as a faulty hard drive or a loose connection. In some cases, the error may occur due to a failed startup sequence or issues with the console's internal storage. Hardware malfunctions can interfere with the proper functioning of the Xbox One leading to error codes like E203. To troubleshoot Xbox system error E203, several potential solutions can be attempted. First, perform a hard reset of the Xbox One is a good initial step. This involves holding down the power button on the console for around 10 seconds until it shuts down completely. Afterward, unplugging the power cord from the back of the console, waiting for a few minutes and then plugging it back in can help clear any temporary glitches. If a hard reset doesn't resolve the issue, the next step is to attempt a factory reset. However, it is important to note that the factory reset erases all data and settings on the Xbox One, so it should be considered as a last resort. To perform a factory reset, users can follow instructions provided by Microsoft on their official Xbox support website or consult the console's user manual. If the error persists after a factory reset, it may be necessary to seek professional assistance from Microsoft customer support or visit an authorized service center. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, then don't forget to press the like button. Also, do share it with your friends and families. For more videos like these, do subscribe to Kosifunda YouTube channel. You can read more such amazing blogs on our website. Visit kosifunda.com. Link is in the description box. Do check it out. See you in the next video.